Hello, it's Jason Pinto taking over the Grow Socially video booth today with the man. Howdy, Graham Spector. Um, huge thing in social yeah. media marketing that we want to talk about today, Google Plus. Some immediacy here. <laughs> Indeed. Uh, we've had people bribing for invitations mm -hmm. left and right throughout the office. So for those of us fortunate, fortunate enough to have been on it. Yeah, it's kind of like I finally get to sit at the cool kids table. <laughs> That's how I feel. It's at, long, at the age of 25, I'm finally at the cool kids table because I'm in Google Plus <laughs> this week. Count it. Yes, and I am. <laughs> that failing, though, has been justified, I think, because yeah. we all have been happy with what Google Plus allows you to do mm -hmm. with its potential. Yeah. And so the thing we want to talk about today is we all obviously work with printers a lot of time. Yes. Should printers care about Google Plus? I would say the answer is a resounding yes. Um, I feel that the opportunities that Google Plus is going to provide um, from a social networking basis, but also uh, content sharing and interaction, engagement, and online conversations, any industry is going to be able to capitalize on this, especially the print industry. Yep, I agree. Um, I know the printers sometimes, it's gotten better, but sometimes they're shaky about social media. Yep. But so I was just thinking of a few reasons why they should care about Google Plus now. Um, one, as with any hot tool in marketing, marketers are the first ones there. Absolutely. And guess who buys print? A lot of times it's the marketing department. Marketers. So to me, if you're a printer, get on Google+. Plus. You're going to be communicating with marketers a lot easier than you might be able to in another channel that already has hundred, hundreds of millions of people. Right. And I feel Google+, Google Plus really kind of cut the middleman out in terms of Facebook, in comparison to Facebook or Twitter, rather. There's no usernames. There's no... Uh, as Mr. T would say, jibber jabber going out <laughs> on the left and right. You, you have the person's name, uh, their employer. It's very similar, I would say, to LinkedIn, yeah. um, where, you know, over here at Grow Socially, we tell our clients and anyone who comes to us for advice about LinkedIn that uh, the best feature there is the online discussions and engagement and the chance to actually make real life connections in a social networking world. Google Plus is really going to take that and piggyback on top of it and show the importance of content too because one of the best features in Google Plus in my limited time playing around with it is uh, how easy it is to share content whether that's links to blog posts, photos, the immediacy of uh, videos being yeah, uploaded. Exactly. We yeah. just uploaded our uh, video before this yeah. up on Google Plus recently just to kind of test it out. The resolution looks great because of course Google and YouTube are BFFs. <laughs> so everything there in terms of content is very easy to be shared and I love the the private, not so much privacy settings but the circles feature. You, It's uh, basically like having uh, groups in Facebook where you know you're gonna send this particular message out to this particular group of people. Uh, the circles feature on Google Plus is going allow, to allow you to do exactly the same thing. It's very cut and dry. You click and drag people into different uh, circles so you know exactly who's going to, see, to be seeing what message. And for marketers, that's the best thing in the world. True. Um, for the printer, though, the other thing that I was thinking is they care. everyone cares about SEO. They oh, care yeah. about what someone searches for, the help they need, they're going to find you. Google Plus makes it easy for people to give the old plus one to content yes. there. And so if you're worried if your content's gonna show up, I guarantee that Google is gonna to continue to take that what's been plus one into account, into their al Very algorithms. So. And so if you wanna be found, get content on Google Plus, get people to plus one it, and I think that's gonna help people find your print business. Absolutely, one, another thing we like to say over here at Grow Socially is that uh, one of the kings of SEO is links, yeah. and the other one is content by being uh, provided consistently. So if you have a blog that's being consistently updated, like over here at Grow Socially, we're uploading YouTube videos, posting blogs all the time, that's great, and that's gonna help your website be found, but if it's, if it's not being shared out there on social networks like Google+, like Facebook, and like Twitter, so people can keep linking back and forth to your website, that's really gonna help keep your website alive and thriving. Yep, I completely agree. And then the last piece I'd say for printers is, is printers love going to shows. Um, mm -hmm. They love, they, a lot of them join groups on LinkedIn to communicate yep. with others. Google has some of those features, with whether it's Hangout or Huddle. Yes. Those features are obviously in their infancy, but they allow people to collaborate online, whether through video, whether through chat, help each other build 
your business together, I think uh, people will be able to take advantage of those features sooner than later. I think Google Plus is one of the first social networks to really thrive on the community aspect of yeah. social networking. It's really it's a, been a very interesting uh, couple days here. Uh, Grow <laughs> socially toying around with this new uh, toy. Basically, it's been like Christmas this week. <laughs> if you're a printer, feel the excitement. Get an invitation. Hopefully, everyone will be allowed on it sooner than later. But. Uh, from us, we think it's going to be uh, a great marketing tool for the print industry and a lot of others too. So stay tuned. Thanks a lot.